Hi, this is Carrie for Granny Bee's Chalk Paint Company. Today we're going to be using the Redesign with Prima acrylic stamp sets with Granny Bee's awesome chalk finish paints. You can easily stamp with the paints by applying the paints to the acrylic stamp with a sponge. I like to use a sponge that has a nice even surface, flat edges, and I just go over the stamp. I don't dig in too hard because then it'll distort the image of the stamp. It goes on really beautifully. You just tap away at the image and then also tap away once you lay it down and carefully lift up. Here I'm using the linear set to add some white bouquets to my overall design. I'm using Daisy and I'm also incorporating the Mystic Rose step set which is a layering stamp system. I am applying Daisy to the base layer and then I'll apply two more colors. Each flower has um, the Daisy on the bottom and then I added uh, an orange color to the second layer of the large flower and strawberry shortcake to the second layer of the smaller flowers. Each stamp is labeled with letters and an arrow that goes up so it tells you which way to stamp the flowers once you start adding the layers. I'm also doing the leaves that also go along with the Mystic Rose set as well. I finish off the florals with the red velvet Granny Bee's chalk finish paint. It adds a beautiful contrast. It has all the flowers look the same. Just tap in each layer and allow your paints to dry before you apply each layer so that your colors don't mix up once you're adding the next color. Here I like to fill in with the leaves. Sometimes I add paint to just two of the leaves instead of all three just so I can add a little bit here and there to fill in the design. And then the last layer is using Peppermint Twist. Next, I go over the design with smaller stamps from the same sets. I add a little bit of uh, color that matches my overall color scheme going on and it fills in the bouquets nicely. I will also use some of the same colors that I used in the flowers just to carry that color through the design as well. These are really fun and easy to use. You can wash them with warm water and soap and I just wash them in the sink. Next, I'm adding the Rosie Papa G's Deluxe Gillers Paste to bring out some of that pink that's in the flowers and add a little bit of a metallic sheen to accent the tray. I really love how it turned out. 